Okay, at long last, we've got an actual official trailer for The Witcher Season 2. I have watched at least like one or two other things relating to Season 2 of The Witcher. I'm looking forward to this. I enjoyed the first season quite a bit. I made a regular habit or, well, that's redundant. I made a habit of watching an episode every day and then making a review sort of discussion type video about it. And that was a lot of fun. I'm going to try to do that also for this. So just let's go ahead and jump into it and see what we've got in store for us. Something has changed, girl. The world's acting strange these days. The North and South at war. Monsters roaming when they should be hibernating. Oh, I love this scenery. Maybe it's the end of days. Are you willing to sacrifice your life? Right, right, I've lived through three supposed end of days. It's all horseshit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this continent was meant for no one. None of us will have any peace. Until there are no monsters left in the world. Everybody know. That's my home. My fight. Your precious leader's after something. You're a pawn to get to it. We build our forces. Strengthen our numbers. We are an empire. The war's just begun. I like the camera work on this. There is of course. He's completely badass. Our best chance. It's the face of Cabin in the woods. Are you ready for this? What you say about that girl's power is true. You can't help her. Group. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> Man, myth, legend. We need your help. Fine, but first, gentlemen, it's been an honor. Oh. What? I made new friends. Get <laughs> over it. Jealous. Okay. This guy. <laughs> this guy's a mess. Okay, so I was actually going to mention that before I started watching this, that the length looked like it, it was pretty hefty. But it, it didn't take up the full video time. It's 2 minutes 35 seconds to get to this point. This is not very far away now. And it didn't feel like the trailer was this long. I think I was having so much fun watching how it was put together, watching the camera work and the choreography, fight scenes and stuff. And just the, I like the color palette. There were some shots that were just, they, I just, there was something about them that I liked them so much. It looked like something you could just capture in a photograph and mount it on your wall. I, I really thought that was cool. I'm, I'm looking forward to this a lot. I had heard and I... I'm pretty sure it's going to be accurate just be, just because of how everything ended up with season one. So, you know, with season one, there was all this back and forth and it was confusing with the timeline. I hope this isn't making too much noise. It was confusing with the timeline because it, it took me a bit to figure out what the heck was going on. And uh, by the time I did, then it was it, I could follow it. OK, but that was a little frustrating. So with this one. I thought I heard it confirmed or people were making the supposition. And of course, I think the same way because it just makes sense that it's going to be a more linear time frame that we're that will be in for season two, which I think will probably make it. I'm uh, we haven't seen it yet, obviously, but I'm thinking it's probably going to make it a better season overall because it just won't feel so clunky with the back and forth. 
And maybe if I go back and rewatch season one, I, I that won't bother me as much. But that was obviously, you know, my first impression with it. And it was confusing, but I, I still enjoyed it. It didn't matter. I, I, I enjoyed it. That's kind of a minor ish complaint to me. I mean, you know, once you figure out what's up, then it's OK. But I'm thinking that this being told in a more linear fashion will make it easier to follow and will just provide, hopefully, a, a, a better overall viewing experience. So I'm, I'm, I'm digging this. I, I mean, come on. It's Henry Cavill. He's so freaking cool. And he, he looks really cool with, the, with white hair, you know, and he wields that sword and he just kicks butt all over the place and he just, he's all into it. So I'm, I'm, definitely going to be checking this out sooner than later if something else comes out oh yeah on, on the 17th also uh spider-man unless it ends up getting changed i don't i had heard hints or sort of like little things here and there that it might get pushed back but we're getting closer and closer to it so i would be super surprised if it does get pushed back i guess we'll see um oh yeah but speaking of spider-man so I may be having like a live stream, doing a, a live stream with some with some fellow um, YouTube content creators about Spider Man, No Way Home. Is what is the name of it? No Way Home. It's um, I'll, I'll put a link to their channel. I, I have not never had them on my channel before, but we may do a like a, I'll go live stream with them, and then they'll come live stream with me. Maybe to talk about oh gosh, what was the movie? Oh, uh, Morbius maybe do a live stream about that. That I think that'll be kind of fun. And so uh, looking forward to that. That's a complete tangent from this, but I got distracted because the date. Okay. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I, I, we're, we got a taste of what we're in for and I'm looking forward to it. Don't know how many episodes it's going to be. I wonder if it's going to be the same, the same number of episodes. Anyway. You can tell the little girl has grown. I call her a little girl. She wasn't a little girl when when the first season was for, was filmed, but she looked like she looks so young and now she's definitely looking more more adultish. She she's a, she was an adult anyway, but she's just looking so much I don't know, just feels like she's aged in the 2 years since we saw The Witcher. Of course, that's not I mean just I don't know, she just she looked like such a little kid, and now she looks like an adult, a grown-ass woman, even though she always was. But anyway, I'm curious to, to know how much time will have passed between season one and this one, because I have not read any synopsis summary or anything about this. So, you know, I don't know if they're going to say it's been a couple years, she's been doing training, or what the heck ever. I have no clue. We'll find out when the time comes, won't we? And I will be right there watching it with everybody else. Okay, well, I don't have anything else. I'm actually filming this in the middle of the day. It's been a while since I've done something like that, but I'll be away this uh, this evening. I'm going to go watch Last Night in Soho, and so I won't have time really to film anything. So I wanted to get this under my belt and uh, hopefully get it up before the end of day. We'll see. Okay, you guys. Adios. <laughs>